everybody. I have a small Tuesday morning haul. Whoops. And something fun that I got at Michael's that I wanted to share with you. Okay. So, first I found some of these vinyl bows. Pleather, excuse me. I thought they were really pretty. That'd be fun to use. So I got some of those. I found this chipboard. Summer, fun, fun, fun package. Um, let's see. Found some Jen Hatfield. I love these little wooden signs. So Pick that up. I picked up this Gemini stamp set with the candles and the cake stand. And it's got fun little sayings and strawberries and roses. I think it'll be pretty fun to play with. So there's that. I found the little birdie, a more moi. And I'm sure you guys have seen this before, but I thought it would be good basic paper to add a big punch of color to or whatever. I got the Purple Passion Ephemera, 36 pieces for $1.49. They're very pretty. I like that. I found the paper. And I'm not going to open it up because I know you guys have seen it, but it comes with... These are stickers. So that's pretty. And I found the fairy paper. And I'm sure you guys have seen that before, too. It's just soft and lavender and... Pre-punched doilies, journaling cards, and fussy cutting. So that's pretty. And then I found this Authentique Pad confection. And I love Authentique. I've never seen one I didn't like. This is two of each paper. This says banana bread, chocolate chip cookie, all kinds of desserts. And then it's got chocolate candies there, sprinkles, ice cream cones. It's just pretty pink pattern, some cut aparts. I wish I can see that. Hmm. There we go. Cut all those cut aparts. All you need is love and chocolate. Okay. Let's see, that's the wrong way. Where is it? Let's see. Let's see if it says here. What's it? No, it says nothing. So anyway, you get several pieces of the same thing. But that's okay because I love it. And I have um, donut dies and cupcake dies and ice cream. And, you know, I think I could do a lot of cute things with it. I have that little... Um, um, like cart on wheels that I can make an ice cream stand or a chocolate stand. Anyway, there's that. I found some Love and Lemon Trim for $1.19. And this is all burlap, kind of rustic hemp, twine, lace. Good for masculine, some of it. So I thought I'd be able to use that a lot. I found the purple. Um, butterflies. I got two of those. Because I love to just add one of these like to the inside of a card. Just add a little something sweet in there. I got these um, Tim Holtz page pockets. And I'm not positive how I'm going to use these yet, but I we got the little um, notebooks. So... I'll definitely figure something out for that. I found this set of Brad's uh, Uptown by Love and Lemon. I love all these colors. That says pow. Be epic. Why not? Anyway, I thought those were very pretty. 
I got this Bill Binder Celebrations build a tag. So it has the embossing, these two embossing plates, and then these two edges. And I thought that would be a handy thing to have. And I got this um, stamp set for $2.99. And I like the little bird. I like the leaves. I like this, this hill scene. I think you could do a lot of things with that. And of course you could with this branch, you could make that Halloween or Christmas or whatever. And it's got a little cloud. Wishing you a great day. And it says it has bird branch metal dies that go with it, but I would just use it to stamp. And then I found two packs of these pretties. And that's all they had. They must not stick very well because they're, but it's so hot that it's possible that they got so hot they just let go for a little bit and then when they cooled back off they stuck back on but those are these aren't pearly they're like milky kind of kind of like a cat's eye um, stone and then I found silver and gold of these tags 15 pieces for $1.19 and the twine that goes with them thought those would be handy and I found the yellow love and lemon packing twine 50 yards enough to share and still have enough forever <laughs> and then at Michael's I was in the party section and they have this stuff marked down Okay, so it is crepe paper fringe is what it's called. And Tim Holtz makes some of this. And that's where I saw it. I saw a video that he was doing of um, some of his Halloween stuff. But I've never seen it in person. And I wanted orange, but then they didn't have orange. But I got the colors that they did have because I think you could really use this. So it starts out flat like this and then you just roll it in your hand and um and the more the rougher it gets the, the cooler it is i think and you could line something with it you know you could line a rosette with it you could make it look like 3d water with this particular color um you know you could just make a border with it i, I just think that I'll be able to use it for so many things. And so, they had it in turquoise and red. That'll be good for Christmas. Silver. This silver one kind of stinks. It's got a real chemical smell. I guess it's, I hope it goes away. But anyway, it'll be really neat. And, um, you know, I got those uh, shadow box things that, um, um, Dollar Tree, and I thought, how cute would those be? You know, lined with some of this, you know, or on the roof, or just I thought it was the neatest stuff. Okay, so the silver stinky, but I got silver. I didn't know it was stinky till I got home. I got royal blue and white. I already said red and black. And the reason it's out of the package is because I um, put it in Happy Mail for somebody. So, put, I shared it with somebody. So anyway, I think that is just the neatest stuff. I sure do wish they had it in orange, like I said, for Halloween. But the black will be really neat. Um, I don't know how it would take to be sprayed with maybe distress ink or something lightly. I don't know. You know, crepe paper has a way of um, disintegrating when it gets wet. But anyway, I wanted to share that with you guys. Um, almost time for fireworks to start going off here, so I am going to 
say goodbye. Hope y'all had a fabulous 4th of July so far. Spent a good time with your family and friends. Y'all be safe during the fireworks. If you shoot them or go to them, enjoy them. Love your family. God bless America. Talk to y'all next time. Bye.